My name is Lamar Archer and today I'll be giving you a walkthrough of checking the functions and the operation of your wash, washer and wiper system on this 8600 International. So what you want to do is put the key in the on position, engine off, and you're just going to go through the, each function of the wipers. So starting with high, make sure that works, good, go to the low function, good, and you're going to go through each of your intermittent functions, make sure they work. You're also going to want to check your washer fluid function. Make sure that operates. Just push the button. Make sure fluid comes out evenly on both sides. Good. Make sure it works also in the high function. All right. And turn that off. Now, in the event that your wipers don't come on, or there's an issue with the wipers, one of the functions. One of the components you could check are your relays. You have your high and low function relay, and you have your wiper power relay. The uh, best way to check them would be to take them out and actually check the pins to make sure there's continuity and make sure that your coils are working inside the relay. Now we're just going to step to the outside of the vehicle to show the other components. All right, here on the outside of the vehicle, you have your fill point for your washer fluid. The actual reservoir for the washer is located underneath the hood. Rather, underneath the cab, uh, we actually pulled one off to show you. And it's like this it has a pump on the upper side and also a sensor for checking levels. We go around to the front of the vehicle. Yeah, step up there. System, you're basically checking the motor, linkage, the operation of the wipers, the operation of the washer, and you just want to also inspect your hoses going to and from the reservoir tank. Make sure they're not cracked, dry, dry rotted, or damaged. And that is basically inspecting the wiper washer system for this International 8600. All right.